Hello everyone, now I'm going to look at the fourth film by uh, Daniel Craig as uh, James Bond in the film Spectre. I'm Gano Mancini. In the meanwhile, you can see a short clip from the trailer. It was me, James. The author of all your pain. The story continues from uh, Skyfall where we see uh, M dying and now uh, James Bond has gotten a um, video message from uh, M to find a man and kill him. In the investigation uh, James Bond uh, goes to this uh, point where he meets uh, Wind as we seen in uh, Casino Royale and this uh, organization. And then uh, James Bond has to uh, save this uh, girl by this uh, organization. The film is uh, well written, well directed and well produced. Also the acting is uh, really good. But some of the action sequences and also the car chases are a little too long. Also the pacing of the film is also a little too long. Get away from me! Why should I trust you? Because right now I'm your best chance of staying alive. This organization you know what it's called? Its name is Spectre. Now to some stars to this film. I think the film deserves 6 out of 10 stars because pacing of the film is too slow and also the action sequences and the car chases is uh, too long. Also I think uh, the film is uh, two and a half hours long and can be shown to two hours. Also I love the part where they are in uh, Mexico and they have like uh, 1000 actors to do the scene. But it is an entertaining film to watch. And if you haven't watched all the four films by Daniel Craig and uh, James Bond, so I think you should get a martini and watch these James Bond films.